Buddy V's Fighters to Watch. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Fighters to Watch are fun because this first one from the scrapyard, I actually had to wait to submit because the video wasn't even released yet. And I had to get this on here because this just happened at the three year anniversary. Holy shit. That's all I'm going to say. But Kevin or Kanikin, sorry. This guy was unassuming. Didn't talk to anyone the entire time. Nice, respectful, very polite. As soon as the cage door locked, his face turned. And all I'm going to say is, holy shit. The way he did his opponent was slick. And as you see here, he even gave him a second before knocking him out. So, I mean, I want to see more of him. I truly do. And afterwards, he just said vibrations and, and sound. But, Hell yeah, let me see some more of that chakra enlightenment. <laughs> Street Beast West Coast. This one's a good one. Handsome Devil. I was yeah. watching this fight. Yeah. Ooh, so, okay, no. I was watching this fight. I saw some of the skill come out, and I would like to tight guard. He knew what he was doing, and every punch he threw, he threw for a reason. And after he ended up coming away from a nice, good fight, I was like, I want to see some more of this guy. Please give him another opponent. Please. So I want to see the Handsome Devil out there again. That's for damn sure. Last one. It's from the OG yard itself, Slick Jack. This was crazy because the man he fought, I actually was a fan of and was a fighter to watch. He came out and made light work of him. Like some people just got it, and man, this man was putting in work. So for that simple reason alone, he had to be a fighter to watch. Because sometimes these people come out and, you know, they might just do one or they're going to come out and do about ten. So please do some more Slick Jack. Those are my three fighters to watch.